This project is uh, called Refugee Stream into Your Town and I documented this uh, back in 2015 when the refugee influx happened in Balkan. Uh, it was incredible to experience this uh, really massive influx of refugees um, just in front of my home. Usually I do stories around the world, uh, you know, in Arctic, Africa, and this happened just one hour away from my village. And um, what you see here are portraits of uh, local people that uh, have uh, experienced a very unique situation. Uh, this is village Rigonci on the border between Slovenia and Croatia. And just in two weeks, uh, over 100,000 refugees walked through their village and their fields. I was uh, one of the first uh, photographers on the field and I couldn't believe what was going on. Um, the government was not really prepared and uh, so you... I've seen a really mixed uh, response from the local people. Uh, some of them were really helpful, they organized some help and food and shelter. Uh, but many were very scared and they were um, afraid of what might happen. And uh, at some point um, I was also working for National Geographic on this story and uh, I just realized that it's also important to tell story from the locals, the sort of European perspective. And I decided to take portraits of local people in front of their houses um, because it was a situation that you could see every day. Uh, for example, some people were really angry because they couldn't go to school, there were helicopters flying around. Um, but some people were very empathetic, uh, especially older generation. Uh, they were refugees uh, them, themselves uh, back in the Second World War. So it was very intense. Um, one month of, uh, of this situation, uh, basically refugees had to walk from Croatia to a certain town in Slovenia for about a few hours and that went on and on for about two weeks until they finally agreed to uh, help them with buses and trains uh, on their way to Austria and Germany. So most of these people, um, most of the refugees, they were just trying to get to the north of Europe and uh, they were passing through this village of Regency and uh, yeah, the local just couldn't believe what's happening. Um, yes, that's basically it.